golden stool is what the Asante Hennes sits on. It's a divine throne from the heavens, conjured by a confanoche on Friday. So it is called Sikega Kofi, a stool that was born on Friday. Mm. <laughs> yes, a stool that was born on Friday. And the seat is not a sacred. Not everybody come close to it, sit on it. It's not a daily stool that the, the Asante sits on. And this Sikajakufi has also a chief to it that maintains it. It's carried. The, to, so it comes out every five to ten years when they are celebrating the big Aquisidae festival. And that is really big when it comes out. So it's a divine throne that the Asantas sit on. So right now, it's a privilege for the Asantini to be and they worship this If I say worship, not in terms of the idol, right, that is, right. and that is what led to the Yasantua War. The Yasantua wanted to protect the golden stool, and therefore she had to fight for it. Other historians or other researchers or other things, or other people are also of the view that because of the golden stool. Prep the second don't want the British to capture or take the golden stool. That's why he gave himself up for them to arrest him and take him into exile in order for them not to have the stool. So all the cars you see here, they are all staffs for coming to the palace. Now the the chief the Asantehene sits on all matters regarding tradition, land litigation, chieftaincy disputes, and everything. He is the one also can also destroy and destroy, except all the other traditional areas have their chiefs and others. Now he sits on the apex, so when they select you have to come and swear allegiance. And the chiefs are from here all the way to Bono region. So it is path. And it's a real opportunity for you to see and sit and greet Bono. Thank you. So we are waiting for.